two-on-one. It's kind of a variation on a two-on-one. You've, you've got to see what I'm doing with my upside hand. All right? So I'm clearing the collar tie when I come across. Now, instead of coming underneath, all right, instead of coming underneath, I'm coming right inside. I'm coming right inside here, all right? I can pin it against his chest. Now, I like being in here because he doesn't know what the hell I'm doing, excuse me, heck I'm doing. So he's going to back up a little bit, all right? And I use this in folk style to set up my, my head outside. All I'm going to do is I'm just going to release the wrist and using my top hand, I swing it out, all right? I'm showing them the folk style, okay? <laughs> so we're coming over top. Now in Greco, all right, we're going to swing that arm out. We're going to change our level, go right to our body, okay? <coughs> and then got it. So I'm coming over top. I'm releasing the wrist. I'm doing this motion. I'm just changing my level. Right to a body lock. Coach, adjust your angle a little bit. What are you doing on Jack? Can you see all right? Yeah, Jackson, circle a little bit to uh, your right. Circle right. Yeah. Okay. So he's pushing in a little bit. He's pushing in a little bit. All right. I'm going to release. Pop. Very similar to what we did with the two-on-one, where from underneath, we swung out the arm. We're just changing the position of our hand. It may feel really awkward. That's fine. Some of you might like it. You know, you guys with really long arms, maybe you can really wrap around it. I don't know. 